Hey guys, I'm coming on to do a four card random reading. Let's see if we get a good energy. Thank you guys for your likes, shares, and subscribes. I thank you for everything. Comment, like, and share. I love all the feedback. I'm trying to get to the comments um, personally, you know, and um, sometimes when I try to um, go into the comments, it might, I guess the system is kind of slow, so a lot of times it won't let me go into um, manage comments to reply to you guys. But before I go, on, before I do this random four card reading, I want to um, answer someone's question. They text me, I mean, they emailed me earlier, and they said um, basically they were informed in the Aquarius reading that someone hated them. Correct. This person in this reading today, for one. That's two separate readings, okay? But I do want to tell you guys, um, gender does not matter in tarot, okay? Tarot is past, present, and future. From what I'm understanding, tarot is either three to six months out in the, in the present, okay? But it could have already happened, and I tell you guys that in my videos. Um... Take what applies to you, and if it doesn't apply to you, leave the rest, and then maybe the next video apply to you. But guys, astrological signs, like I'm an Aquarius, but I may have Libra in my chart. I may have Gemini in my chart. Matter of fact, I'm Aquarius, and I have Taurus in my chart. So therefore, I can go look at a Taurus reading, and it can possibly resonate with me. So, in the Aquarius reading, I've seen a lot of water signs, okay? But the message that I did today, it had nothing to do with the Aquarius reading. Or maybe it does. It's up to you guys to, to take it if it fits your life. But the way tarot works, guys, if the person is still doing the same things, the universe is going to pick up on that. If the person is not only doing the same things, but if the person is not stopping, it's going to keep coming up in the readings. The Holy Spirit is, and the universe is picking up on these readings. Okay? So that's why it seems like, well, you know, maybe um, this person keeps coming up in this or that reading. You're absolutely correct. If you listen to other readers, they'll tell you, too, why does this person keep coming up in my reading? That's true. Because this person is not stopping. And that's why I told you guys today, it's up to you to use your discernment. I can't make you believe what I'm saying. I try my best. Okay? I try my damnedest. And every time I have, when I was in this reading this morning, and all my cards was 555, five, five, guys, this is, this message is, all my messages are very serious. But this message right here and the one from um, the Aquarius reading, I'm telling you, I was hot, I was sweating. I mean, I could feel the energy. But again, I pray to the Holy Spirit, to my ancestors, everyone, that you guys use your discernment. Because the one today really upset at Emperor Shea Shea. This person not only hates you, they want to end you. And it may or may not be the same person in Aquarius reading. That is correct. But as long as the Holy Spirit is giving me the downloads, I got to get the message out. Even though it may sound repetitive, the message has to come out. But what should scare you guys? If the message is repetitive, that should make you think even more. Oh my God. Let me be mindful of what's going on in my life. Let me see. Let me start analyzing the people I'm hanging around or what am I doing in my life. When I listen to Tarot, guys, even if it doesn't fit my life or resonate with me, I still keep it in the back of my mind because, again, that could be something that resonates with me six months down the road. I'm going to tell you something. 
Something happened to me when I, when I first got into Tarot and I was listening to a reader. That reader saved me from something really bad happening to me. And all I can do is fall to my knees and say, Father God, I thank you. So don't never say it don't resonate. Well, at that time it may not resonate. But even if it doesn't, still be aware and mindful. Okay? And I hope I answered this person's comment. And I love your feedback. Always give me comments. Okay? Because something you guys don't understand, I want you to understand. Spirituality and tarot sometimes can be a bit scary. And that's why I, I want to break it down for you guys. But you may go back and look at a past reading from, my, from the summertime and it may resonate with the Aquarius video. Or it may resonate with something I'm saying today. I promise you that. But never count it out, guys. Because this is messages from the Holy Spirit. And the one I had this morning woke me up out of my sleep. Okay? I can bring the horse to water, but I can't make him drink. That's real. Okay? So let me do this four-card random reading because I don't want to go, you know, over. But guys, and again, tarot does not, gender does not matter in tarot for the ones that don't know. Okay? Signs really don't matter. I may just stop doing signs. I may. You know, signs don't really matter. Take the message. Okay? Like Aquarius may have looked at their video and it may not resonate with their sign or somebody may look at that there was an Aquarius and it probably resonated and they may be a Taurus but have Aquarius somewhere in their chart. That's how tarot works. Okay? Let me do this four card reading. I'm, I'm shuffling and what I'm going to do is just pick the cards. Spirit is leading me to give you guys this, this, this feedback and to um, pull a four card. Okay, it's a random reading. Okay, tempers card in reverse. Didn't I just tell you the universe is on top of it? Queen of Wands. Guys, I cannot make this up. Do y'all see? Do you uh, do you guys see what what Empress Shay Shay is saying? This person is watching this Queen of Wands. Okay. This person is very unstable, very unbalanced. They are juggling the thought as to when and where they're going to make contact. Now, you see me just, just shuffle these cards. You see what I'm saying, guys? This is what Empress Shay Shay is saying. And see, Spirit just um, spoke to me and told me to do a four card reading on this um on this um comment that I'm I mean on this video that I'm giving you guys. This person is very anxious. This is what tempers in reverse mean guys. This part what well, means many things, but what I'm seeing now, it means this person's out of balance. This person is stressed out and anxious and that's why they watching you because they feel like this Queen of Wands have gotten away from them. Okay? And they're juggling their thoughts, probably juggling it, different bitches. But they in two minds as to when they're going to come in on this Queen of Wands. And this is just a four card reading. Okay? This is just a four card reading. I'm going to pull one, one more just to be able to look at this. This person. Feels like they in prison. They missing this Queen of Wands. They very upset and they hurt. And they're all in their mind. That's all I'm going to say to you guys. You can bring a horse to water, but you can't make them drink. This is my four-card reading. Love you guys. Light and love.